I'm Adil Kumar sharing with you a test question on dot products. We are given vectors u and v. Given 8u minus v and 4u plus 2v are perpendicular vectors and the magnitude of v is twice the magnitude of u. Find the smallest angle between u and v. Now to solve, we know these two vectors are perpendicular. That means their dot product should be zero. So 8u minus v dot 4u plus 2v should be equal to 0. All right. So let's perform this dot product. 8 times 4 is 32. So we get 32. Uh, so that is magnitude of u squared. And then we have plus 16 u dot v. And then we have minus 4 v dot u and we get minus 2 magnitude of v square equals to 0. So u dot u is magnitude of u square, v dot v is magnitude of v square. We can combine the log like terms, these two are the like terms. We are also given that the magnitude of v is twice the magnitude of u. So we can convert v into u. So we have here 32 u square. Uh, let me first write all v in terms of u. So, uh, so we have 32 magnitude of u square. Now here we could write this as 16 u v magnitude of u magnitude of v cos theta. And this is minus 4 magnitude of u, magnitude of v, cos theta. If theta is the angle between these two, and we have minus 2, magnitude of v, whole square equals to 0. Now, substituting v as twice the magnitude of u, we get 32, magnitude of u square, plus, here we get twice 32, that means 32, magnitude of u square cos theta. Here we get minus 8 magnitude of u square cos theta. And here we get minus. Now this is v square will be 4 times 2, 8, right? And magnitude of u whole square equals to 0. Now let's combine the like terms. We got 32 u square and 8 u square. That gives us 24 magnitude of u square and the cos theta terms we have 32 and 8 oh, which is uh, when you take away you get this also as uh, plus 32 minus 8 is uh, uh, again 24 right so 24 magnitude of u square cos of theta right so now when we have this equals to 0. So taking cos theta to the right side, uh, what we get here is we can take like this. So 24 can cancel or you can write 24 magnitude of u square cos theta is equals to minus 24 magnitude of u square. So cos theta basically equals to minus 24 magnitude of u square divided by 24 magnitude of u square. Clearly, it is equal to minus 1. And uh, what is the angle which gives you negative 1 for cosine? So in a cosine wave, as you know, it starts with 1, right? And that is minus 1. For If you want to write in degrees, it is 270 degrees or 3 pi by 2. Right? So so that gives you the angle theta as equal to 270 degrees or you can write 3 pi by 2. Correct. So that becomes the closest angle which will satisfy the given condition. So from here clearly we get that the angle between the vectors u and v is 270 degrees or you can say 3 pi by 2 radius. 
So I hope it is absolutely clear. Feel free to write your comment, share your views. If you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for your time and all the best.